Okay, hello again and welcome back to Pioneer. Today we are on Santos Colony at Allentown. Well, we finished off last time at uh, Westerhof Oasis, I think, uh, where we were looking to take an elimination mission. So, I have gone ahead and bought the Hypercloud Analyzer. I don't know if we're going to need it, but it's something I figure we could use for these kind of missions. And I'll uh, analyze the hyperspace clouds to determine destination and time of arrival or departure. Okay, so today at Allentown, there are not only one, but two of these uh, removal missions, two of these assassination elimination missions we've got one for officer Ethel Lewis and the Dolashiel Dolashiel the Dolashiel system and one for corporal Nello Galezi in the Ophelia system and uh, Lewis here or Ethel Lewis here is a little more expensive so she is probably the one we're gonna want to take so let's see. let's see. This is the first time. This is actually like the very first time I've ever done this. No research. No. Um, no. What? No testing. Nothing. So this could be disastrous, or it could turn out well. So let's take a look at this mission. Hi, I'm Michelina Willick. I'll pay you a hundred or eleven thousand credits to get rid of Officer. Where can I find Officer Ethel Lewis? Ethel Lewis will be leaving Edelstein platform. The Dolashi system. Dolashiel system. Dolashi. Dolashiel. Uh, distance is 17.92 light years at 4 a.m. 6 November 3227. So, September, October, November. We've got <laughs> two months to get there. Uh, the ship is a Natrix and has a registration ID, TB8407. So, Natrix isn't bad. How soon must it be done? It must be done after Officer Ethel Lewis leaves Edelstein platform. Do not miss this opportunity. How will I be paid? Return here on completion of the contract and you will be paid. Okay. So, uh, we're going to have to do a few saves because <laughs> I'm not entirely sure how well we're going to uh, be able to do this mission. Polson, Collins, Robinson, Langs, Rock, let's see, Nakano, Spaceport, Fortress, Ross, Yeah, Facility, Edelstein Platform. Oh, it's a, it's an orbital starboard. Okay. Okay, that should be interesting. So we need to get here by November. Go ahead and plan the road. It's only going to take us three days to get there. Okay. Uh, so let's see. Dolashio, Dolashio. We can cut a few jumps off our trip. Not really save time, but you know we save. Uh, Fuel, maybe? So 14 tons of fuel, oh, 13 tons of fuel, and it still takes only four days. Because we really don't need to do anything. We just need to get there for. in time. <laughs> Let's see, Terra A. Goodbye. Now, one. Did we make the jump just straight to Delasio? Yeah, we could. It only take a week, ten tons of fuel. <sighs> okay, yeah. We'll just make the jump there. That's pretty simple. <laughs> okay, okay. So, let's get out of here. So, 
So I'm not entirely sure what we should be doing here. I know we leave here and we dock at our target station. Speaking of which, I've already forgotten the name of Edelstein Platform. Okay. We dock at Edelstein and then it's the waiting game. Because we can't go in and blow up a ship beforehand, because that'll fail the mission. And that's the one thing I do know about this. Can't attack the ship until, well, it's time to attack, until it leaves the station. Alright, let's head over to Edelstein. Too far away, only uh, 0.3 AU. You can probably accelerate all the way there. to break. So once we get to Edelstein, we're going to make a save because, well, we have a month and a half of waiting before it's time to uh, attack the target. After that, well, I just hit the time acceleration button. Not exactly um, entertaining gameplay, but that's what happens. You know, I'm sure if uh, a more experienced person was doing this, they'd take the time to do some in-system trading. And this is a nice system. You've got two starports here, and I think there were two on the planet. So, you could definitely make some money while wasting time. But because this is my first time doing this, I'm just going to wait it out. Because honestly, I don't know what's going to happen. This is kind of interesting. Let's take a look real quick. Oh, it's in close orbit, isn't it? This could be a slightly hairy approach. It's not rotating very fast. It doesn't orbit very quickly. Some of these, they just whip right around the planet. I'm going to say, what was it? We're going to have to adjust our course a bit. But, what system was that? Uh, Epsilon Eridani, I think. Eagle's Nest rotates around its uh, planet incredibly fast. This one 
is rather slow. Which is fine by me. That's an easier approach. see the station yet, but we're in a thousand kilometers. Oh. There it is. Particularly large space station, but that's okay. Oh, I guess who wasn't paying attention? I mean, it's not like we have much to worry about. And look at that TB8407. and turn on uh, let's see, forward thrust cruise mode. Yeah, we still stop within like two two kilometers. That's fine. <laughs> uh, let's get docking permission. Uh, docking bin number three. Probably should have turned around. Because there's our target, TB8407. So when this target leaves, when it leaves, it's probably going to fly out that way. So we're going to waste some time by turning around and chasing it. Maybe. But first off, let's, let's gas up. And let's make a save. Call it uh, elimination. And that will be our save. Next up, it's the waiting game. Right, because we have to wait 48 days until November 6th for this. Uh, who was it? Lewis. Officer Ethel Lewis. We have 48 days. A month and a half to wait for this person to, uh, to leave. So we'll go... Go ahead and target it. And it's got a shield, which is not great. But we have a trusty plasma accelerator. So that shouldn't be a problem. 
Okay, so we're here. And it's going to take a month and a half for this to <laughs> look at that. We're going to have a month and a half of this. So I think for right now, <laughs> we'll call this video a day. I know this is shorter than usual, but that's okay. And next time, we'll come back at the 6th of November. Not real life time, but in game time. Because, wow, look at this thing spin. <laughs> yeah, wow. That's nuts. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> so yeah, we'll call it a day here. Uh, we'll see you again on the 6th of November next week in real time. Thanks for watching. We'll see you all later. And goodbye.